What's up guys, Faraway Apple 393 here. If you haven't subscribed, please hit that subscribe button, hit the notification button to never miss an upload, like all five likes, said that really fast. And Takara Tomi has released tons of stuff of leaks and Beyblades that are going to be released, so let's get on with the video. First we have the GT customizer set. Now it comes with uh the get out point of Jimmy. We have Regalia Genesis, Regalia Genesis, and Prime Apocalypse. Now you can see that there is a huge resemblance. So I'm guessing in the anime they're probably twins. Probably one is evil, one is good. Maybe the other way around. But what they look like dragons. Because just look at the faces. Now, with this one, I know it comes with zero. Because from videos I've seen, I can recognize the zero disc from looking through the launch dips, whatever. So, this is a more of an oval shape. And the white and gold and red are really good color combinations. The white, gold, black, and red go really well. Um, they do not come with a weight disc. It is connected to the Katenko chip, I think. And we don't know how it does this, but, okay. Pause the video and grab your Bayer Blade. Okay, so... As you know, when you burst it, you can see the prongs of the disc. If you don't know what I mean by the prongs of the disc, the things that go in the layer and kind of stick out from the ditches in the layer where you put your launcher in. And you can see how it, can, it can't go a full circle. Well, these Beyblades rotate fully. So then how are you going to burst them? Is it like you got to get like 10 rotations for it to burst? I think these bays are going to be really strong, really good. And I'm th I think this is either a balance or either these two are balance, but whether this is an attack type, this is either a stamina or defense. Next base that come with it is Erase Fafnir. Uh, the Erase base comes from Venom Diabolus or Venom Demobolus, which is the t uh, Hasbro name for it. And it comes with a 10 weight. Um, I love the color combination with it. I think that's the around disc. Don't know, but I love the design or not bleh, the colors on it the black, the gold, and the red. And I'm glad we got another Fafnir because we have never, we have not got another Wizard Fafnir release or a release with Gatink, uh, bleh, with the Fafnir Gatinko chip. If I am wrong, well, in this video, there also is a random booster, which has Fafnir in it, which I'll get onto. Next one, we have Cosmo Dragon. Okay. How many dragons do we have? This is ending like, uh, ending up like Emperfornius. If you don't know, Emperfornius was everywhere. It was probably in most of the uh, Chosy random boosters. But one good thing is one of them came with a level chip. So, yeah, just there are tons of Emperor Fornius. And this is happening to Dragon. We do get the Cosmo Layer Base, which is a prize layer from Cosmo Valkyrie. And it comes with the Retsu Weight. So, 
weights on balance because one most of the weights on this point and then most of the weights on these points so it's uneven i'm guessing this is a stamina type oh wait i forgot in the gt custom in the customizer sets there's always one stamina one attack one defense one balance so this would probably be stamina this would be attack that would probably be defense this would be balance oh, okay there we go okay or this the other way around i'm thinking this of a balance type because it's like the defense and then the, but whatever we'll find out so yeah that was the gt customizer set next we have the random layer volume three now we are getting another odin or odax probably most of you are familiar with odax because most people watch english dub probably wrong but we do we are getting an uh knock out odin now odin is a really cool beyblade it is it is owned by orgy gimba and i don't think he's gonna own this because they change all the characters this comes with the gen weight which is cool and a, um and a new layer base knockout she so could have knockout valkyrie knockout joker <laughs> that actually right meant. anyway so we um so with this uh, random lay collection i think this is how it works so i think you can get odin you could get the sand weight and you could get gran so i think it's just a completely random part so we have odin here the gen weight and knockout we have grand sen and pegasus we have hydra I love Hydra, uh, Zan and Venom, and we've got uh, Ashura, no, yeah, Ashura, Metsu, and Judgment. Now we get a, so that was Knockout Odin. Next, we have Random Booster Volume 13 with the uh, prize bay is, oh, I thought um i forgot dax ducked i think it's ducked tack tacked yeah tacked lunar long and longinus sorry i was getting mixed up so we get tacked uh longinus and um we are gonna move on to the other bays that come with it so Tack longness, tack long, oh, but whatever. Um, the layer base looks pretty cool. Now, okay, why did I make it so wide? They look like ovals. Well, anyway, these are meant to be circular. Um, so it comes with a new weight. We have, I believe, we have not gotten the name for it yet, but. It comes with 12 expand and trans dash. Trans is good. Okay. 12 is terrible. Stop giving us 12. And next, babe, we have Lightning El Drago. El Drago, whatever. Now, Drag El Drago is my favorite MF Beyblade. Metal Fusion, Metal Fury, whatever metal fight it is really cool and have a uh, galax storm pegasus from the original random booster that was really good this is left spinning so we are going to get well we have something to counter guys fafnir wizard fafnir dream fafnir long bleh. you know what i mean so that was the two bays. Next we have Dact. Tack Tact. Fafnir with the Sen weight. And uh 
Rock Joker. Now, this color scheme for Joker rocks. Get it? Rock Joker. Not funny. Um, so I love the color scheme. I love the gold, um, rock layer base. So that means if you have the golden sand weight and the golden dragon Gatinko chip, you could have a golden rock dragon. Um, I like the color scheme. Hopefully comes this comes with a dash driver. Wait, I think this comes with Zenith. I just realized. Yeah, that definitely looks like Zenith. Um, moving on to Fafnir. I like the color scheme. Um, nothing really to say. But what's funny is it, it gets a part of its actual stop combo. Um, I don't know if Sen is good. It seems pretty light. This seems really light. Well, that was the those bays. Next, we have Wizard Bahamut and Judgment Pegasus. Wizard Bahamut looks amazing. It comes with a gen weight. The color scheme for it is just... It's just amazing. The blue, the purple, and the, not the purple, the black and the white goes super well together. I can see it comes with double O. Comes with a gen weight, a black one, which is pretty cool. You can spin steel from this with this bay because you got the wizard layer base. Um, so that was Dread Bahamut, not Dread Wizard Bahamut. Next we have Judgment Pegasus. Now that name sounds cool. It's a blood, a crimson blood red color. It looks amazing. That's what I've been saying this part time, uh, whole time, saying it looks amazing because it does. Um, yeah, I don't know what to say about it. The black and the red go well. Um, comes with Metsu, which is okay, I guess, which came on Zawai Longinus, and we'll move on to the next one. Next, we have another Storm Pegasus, and a Bushin Valkyrie. Okay, Valkyrie's colors do not go well. So, it's like full-on blue, and it's like, okay, let's make a Beyblade. That has a full on pink and green Gatinko chip and put it like full on blue for the layer base. Bro, you're making a candy Beyblade or something. Um, it comes with the Metsu, a uh, Retsu weight. Um, moving on to Pegasus, it's just like the metal pieces are just colored blue. I don't really see any difference. Or it's probably an evolution. Anyway, nothing really to say about these bays. These are probably my least favorite out of the whole random mister. And I'll go into the next one. Oh, yeah. The gimmick for the tack layer base is... Okay. So, as you know, with the weight, um, like, sand has three points on it. And, um, this one on the, so the amount of, uh, points you have on your weight, the more blades that will stick out. So if you use the Gen weight, none of the blades will stick out, but this one will only take up two. And, um, so if you can hear people in the background, um, and you can, yeah, the, just the gimmick. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video down there. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.